Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, I'm Midzy69, and welcome back to the channel. Today, we're going to be having a look at two tanks that have come into Blitz Store, the AMX M449 and the Carnarvon Action X. Now, you can get both of these tanks as part of the bundle, fully equipped for 15,000 gold, or you can get the AX for 12,500 and the M4 for 7,500. Now, I would say go for that 15,000 gold offer. For both tanks, for 15,000 gold, I think is a really, really fair price for both of these tanks. They are both really good tanks. Uh, the AMX M4 49, I actually like this tank. Fizzy's been playing this and he wasn't a lover of this tank, but he's been playing it. I've been really busy today. Um, it's my dad's birthday, so we've gone out for a meal. And then I was streaming with my brother on my brother's channel. Uh, go check him out. It's Frag, frag Dicted. Um, completely different to blitz but if you're into your fragrances uh the older generation or some maybe even the younger generation you might like his channel where he just reviews fragrances and stuff like that so do go check him out um he he's, he's trying he's just reached the thousand subscriber mark and he's just actually been monetized so gg tony so the amx m449 it's a french heavy and the arm is actually really good on on this tank really good that's got a, such a strong turret so have to try and hold uh, go hold down in this thing then you will get a lot of bounces i mean the hatch is very weak it is quite a small hatch so it is quite hard to hit if you're moving the gun is okay the gun is okay we're going to have a look i mean 2325 dpm and that's the penetration is 232 and it has 310 alpha um rate of fire 7.5 and that gives you an eight second reload unless you're fizzy who runs it with the calibrated shells uh, that is an 8.6 second reload and the calibrated shells puts your penetration up to 244 so I mean, 12 difference, I personally would run it with the rammer. I think the penetration is is good enough. It is ha It has a 100mm uh, gun with... It has APCR, so that's why I'd probably run it with the uh, with the rammer, because it doesn't change too much. 263 millimeters of pen on your APCR. Now, if you're running it with calibrated shells, it only goes up to 276. So not a not a great difference so i would just rather go with the the dpm the penetration's pretty much good enough as it is uh aim time 2.08 and the dispersion 0 0.335 so the dispersion is not great the dispersion is not great what it does have is an amazing turret with 10 degrees of gun depression uh, so use that 10 degrees of gun depression because it has 250 millimeters of tower armor and of course effective you can get that up much more if you start using that 10 degrees of gun depression it also has 175 millimeters of hull armor so the hull is actually really 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 troll as well especially against the medium tanks you will get some bounces you can see here fizzy has only bounced 815 it hasn't bounced too too much but i mean as soon as people load the gold then they will penetrate your hull and of course they will penetrate that turret of yours so don't just sit in in a position where you're not moving that turret because people will go for that hatch on on the top especially if you are using the 10 degrees of gun depression just try and maybe look up uh, so they can't see the hatch but always try and get your your tank into a hold down position so you can use that 10 degrees of gun depression uh speed wise what is the speed i don't even know what the speed is where's the speed um 40 kilometers an hour so it's pretty quick for a heavy tank uh, the speed is really good so you can actually use this um, maybe to go with the medium tanks to help your mediums out uh, because 40 kilometers an hour for for a heavy tank is pretty good um so it's a nice tank um, hasn't got much side armor. I mean, 55 uh, armor on the side, so people can HE you quite easily. Uh, and it does make some nice credit. So, GG there, Fizzy. Uh, nice win, you and Squishy. Uh, 1300 base XP, which is pretty good. Next up, we have the Action X. Now, the Action X is one of my favorite tanks in the game. Now, 
my favorite premium tank for a while was the Scorpion G. Now the Progetto 46 has probably overtaken that and is as my favorite. I absolutely love it. And this is actually close to overtaking the Progetto 46. This is probably my second favorite premium tank in the game. Do I think it is OP? I do. I do think it is a little bit OP. People didn't think this tank was much when it first came out. Um, but oh my god, what a fantastic tank this is. 2,700 DPM. So more than the uh, AMX. It is a heavy tank as well. Um, 226 penetration. So not as good as the AMX M449. Um, and it only has an 190 alpha shot. But because of the reload on this thing, which is 4.21 seconds, um, you might want to run the calibrated shells on this because the reload is quite short anyway. Uh, the reload goes to 4.5 seconds. So 4.2 to 4.5. I mean, you're not really going to tell the difference. So I would run this with the calibrated shells. Um, the DPM does go from 27, 2700 to 2500, but it's not massive. And your penetration goes to uh, from 2, 226 to 237. And on your APCR, it goes to 271. So because of the short reload, I would run the calibrated shells, uh, 4.5 seconds with the calibrated shells. Uh, it is a, uh, as you know, a tier 8 heavy, uh, a, a, a UK uh, a British heavy. Uh, the aim time is really good at 1.72 and the dispersion is really good as well at 0 0.29. And again, just like the AMX, it has a nice 10 degrees of gun depression. Uh, 36 kilometers an hour speed. And with the 10 degrees of gun depression, you do also have a 254 millimeters of Tara armor, which is fantastic. 152 millimeters on the side of the turret as well. So very, very strong. 130 millimeters of whole armor. Uh, so people are still gonna pen you, but again, you start using that 10 degrees of gun depression with the rate of fire that you've got, you can really perma track uh, tanks, perma track them into position so they just can't move. Um, so this is actually a Hall of Fame game. Uh, it's not number one, actually. I think it's number number two, um, I think. But this is this game shows everything. It shows the damage. It shows the block damage. I mean, this guy is up to 2,200 block damage already. There we go. A bit more. 2,430. 2, and as soon as this guy shoots, with the reload of this thing, again, you can really bully the tanks. If you can use that 10 degrees of gun depression and permatract someone, they're going to struggle to pen you because of the uh, your turret is just amazing. Um and you can just pump that rate of fire out so quickly. It's such a fun tank to play, and I think it is OP. If it's not OP, then it really is borderline OP. It's I love it. I absolutely love it. And if I'm going to play tier 8, this and the Pajetto 46 are my go-to tanks just to have fun. Not, not to make credits. I've got enough credits. These are my go-to tanks just to have fun. This, the Pajetto and the Scorpion G are literally the three tanks I play most now. The Amex M449 is a good tank, it really is, especially if you don't own any of the, the like the Russian heavies, then that is re a really good tank to own. But for 15,000 gold, when you can get both of these tanks, I mean, I personally would pay 15,000 gold for the Carnarvon Action X on its own. Uh, yeah, I would. Definitely would. So for 12,500 for the Canal X on its own, that is still a good buy in my opinion. Yes, it's a lot for a tier eight tank, but it is a fantastic tank. So I do think coming for gold um, at that price, it's still a good price, but definitely I would consider going for the 15K. Uh, you separate them, that's what, seven and a half K gold each. That is a great, great bundle. Now we're going to see here the end of the game, almost 1,000 supremacy points. There we go. And I don't know how the supremacy point, it didn't end the game. I mean, normally it's around five seconds, um, but he got lucky and he managed to get a few more, uh, bit, a bit more damage in at the end there. But what a fantastic game. I mean, all that blocked damage, Lithium, lif 6,377 damage. Wow. So Good bundle, in my eyes. It's worth it. I think it's worth it. But it's up to you. It's your money. It is up to you. Hope you enjoyed it, guys. I'm Meaty, and I'll catch you soon. Bye-bye.